Hello again from my front porch. I'm here with my nephew, Dylan. Say hi, Dylan. Hi, guys. Mia. So, so Dylan graduated from high school last week. Yesterday, we had his graduation party. And today, well, then he came to my place last night. And then today went with me to the Comic-Con, the Wizard World Comic-Con today. And, and all together, Dylan, how many Comic-Cons have you made it to? Just this one so far. Yeah, one counting today. <laughs> So, so he had the, he's had that experience. He's thoroughly exhausted now because it was a long day, a lot of walking around. Yeah, you know? but you got to do some cool stuff. Yeah, made some cool memories. Uh, got to meet a few cool celebrities. Spent a lot of cool bucks. That's <laughs> what you do with these things. <laughs> so, so tell tell them about some of your favorite memories from from this particular event. Well, the first one so far would have to be. I was going to the bathroom. I was being like, oh, it's, it's an interesting memory. Oh, there's more. Oh, yeah. I, was... <laughs> I just dropped it down. And said, <laughs> but on the way to the bathroom, the actor from The Hobbit or Lord of the Rings, huh? Elijah Wood, was coming out of the bathroom and I see him I'm like, oh, you're a celebrity. And I started talking to him before he went pee. And I was like, how are you? <laughs> Great place to start talking. <laughs> um... <laughs> That's one of the top memories because it's just really just random. random. <laughs> uh, the second would have to probably be meeting Bobby from Supernatural. Um, and Jim sitting, Beaver. Jim Beaver. Mm -hmm. And sitting in the Apollo mm -hmm. with uh, you and your friend. We didn't sit in the Apollo together, but we did stand in front of the Apollo with, with, with Bobby and the new death, played by Lisa Berry. We did that. The three of us did that together. Yeah. But... But you, you've got picture, and I did as well, of sitting in the Impala. Oh, my. oh yeah. Here's, 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 here's a picture of, of him with Bobby in front of the Impala holding the Colt. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. Dylan is a proud owner of the Colt. That's right, the Colt. I should probably hide it with some symbols and stuff to make sure I don't get killed. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, so, but not only did Dylan get his picture taken with Bobby in front of the Impala holding the Colt, he also got a signature from Jim Beaver who plays Bobby. So you actually got to go up and talk to him then too and, and get him to sign it, right? He's a lot taller in person. <laughs> yeah, both of them were. Yeah. Both, both he and Lisa Berry, they were, they, were, they were taller than you might expect. So. Jared and Jensen got to be tall. Yeah, Jer the main act, the main characters have got to be really tall because they kind of make these other two look short or normal size. But they were they were they were definitely taller. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you also got to see David Tennant. Yeah. Well, I took pictures of him from a distance. <laughs> No. Yeah, illegally, because David Tennant was going in to do his photo ops, where he's in this area that's that's um, uh, closed up. closed off by curtains, and people paid tickets lining up to go in and get their picture taken with him. And um, there was this little gap in the side curtain there that, that Dylan peeked through, and he had his camera, and he says, "Hi, David." <laughs> Hi, David. And so naturally, instinctively, David Tennant turns and. Way back, <laughs> and he took his picture. <laughs> it's a wonder that security didn't get called right then. <laughs> and he didn't have—he wasn't armed with a Colt yet, so you know. <laughs> I was done for. Yeah, but anyway, so so that was that was great. We we had a great time today, and and you know we we had all the little accoutrements. I had my I took my my tenth doctor's uh, sonic screwdriver with me so I could have David Tennant hold it when I did my picture with him. Um, it was kind of funny too when I handed him the this and the psychic paper. You have to know Doctor Who to understand. When I hand those things to him, I didn't have to give him any instructions. I said, I handed it to him, I said, here, I'm sure you know what to do with these. And he's like, oh yes, yes, I know what to do with these. And he immediately right into, <laughs> right into pose. And I thought, I wonder how many times he's just been asked to do that. And anyway, uh, so, so Comic-Con was fun today and his parents are now gonna take him back home and, and you know, and go on, go on, go on with life. But now, in your postgraduate life, now that you're a high school graduate, what, what are your future plans, Dylan? What, what is it that you're going to be doing as you strike off into the world? Well, I plan on finishing up the summer with baseball mm -hmm. in high school, just finish off high school in general, mm -hmm. 
And then this fall, I am going to Iowa Central for graphic design and mm -hmm. hopefully a sub major in technology. Mm, wow. And along that line, at, at the Comic Con, he was very interested by that there's, there's a large group of, of artists, of comic book artists and illustrators and writers that were there. He was very fascinated by some of those things there too, which ties into your interest with wanting, wanting okay. to do that. So that's, that's cool. So, so you're going to do a couple of years there and then. You and I. And then you and I. All right, cool. Which is the new alma mater for his family because that's where his sister Megan went. And that'll be awesome because that'll, that'll make him only the fourth person in our family to go to college. So good job. Nicely done. All right, so it's starting to get really warm out here because there's no windows open out here on the front porch. And so this is more like welcome to my front sauna. <laughs> and since he's still wearing his Dean Winchester outfit, um, <laughs> It's warm. All right. So with that, uh, see you. Well, thanks for joining, for hanging, out, hanging out this weekend, Dylan. I'm glad you had fun at your first Comic Con. I'm sure, sure you'll go to others in the future, but now he knows what to expect. He knows how much money to take, too. <laughs> A lot. <laughs> All right. With that, I'll see you next time from my front porch. Bye, guys.